mama alijifungua huyo mtoto saisi nikakuja kwa kasi nikakuja ile inaitwa paternity nikapewa muda wa mwezi mmoja kuja kuona eh angalia sasa kitambo hiyo baada ya ku discharge hospitali mimi nikaanza kugonjeka mimi sikukua na nguvu wakati hiyo kwa sababu ni wiki mbili tu ndio nilikuwa na wakati nilijifungua sasa hatukukua tunajua ni nini ndio ilikuwa inamfanya akue mgonjwa nilianza tu kutapika mwili lesi mara nikaenda hospitali kapimwa damu nikaambua my infections nikadumwa mashindano nikawekwa drips mwili ikaanza kutoa chumvi nilikuwa naenda naenda hospitali naenda asubuhi naenda kumwekesha na mletea chai nilikuwa ninatembea miguu mpaka Catholic Hospital sasa ni kama ninatumia dakika 30 minutes kufika so mara ya mwisho wakasema tuyesend na hii ugonjwa so ndio nika kwa refat mpaka Meru hospitali inaitwa Kiro Mission Hospital Wako wakati nilifikishwa nilikuwa critical kabisa. Lakini wa uweso ya Mwenyezi Mungu nika wakati nilipeleka nikajulikana niko na shida ya ya kidney. A lot of things can can affect the kidney. An acute injury to a kidney that is already compromised that it's not showing in your blood work that would lead to a chronic kidney disease. Sasa baada ya hiyo akaambiwa akwe akikuja dialysis twice a week na kitu mimi sikuwa na pesa ile kitu ile mbusi yangu nilikuwa nayo nilimswa uso wakati nilikuwa hapa kaisha wakati wamerudisha habari back to the community tukajua kama kuna mbinu yoyote ambayo tunaweza muokoa maisha yake because jamaa ali, alikuwa karibu karibu aende so sisi wenyewe tukaambiwa ndio kuna namna lakini ni pesa mingi. Tukasema kama ni pesa mingi hata sisi tutatafuta mkono ambaye tutaweza kumsaidia kuona kama atarudi kama alivyo. Walifungua page ya WhatsApp. Changa pesa through hiyo group. Pesa ikapatikana 350. Siku mbili kwa wiki. Nikiamka hapa mandi asubuhi natoka saa tisa ya usiku. So by saa mbili nilikuwa nyuru kuna shukua fawas kiwa kwa hiyo dialysis machine sasa kuanzia hapo tena unaingia gari na kuja nafika hapa saa mbili, saa tatu ya usiku Charles wakati alikuwa ananisumbua hata kuwa naweza na kutembea ninashika mkono ninabeba mtoto ninabeba bagi ya nguo tunaenda mahali kidogo analala kwa barabara kitambo nilikuwa nalipa 6500 per session so kwa wiki nilikuwa nalipa 30 13000. Alafu ya kuna injections ulikuwa unadunga. Unanua kama ya 2000 per week. Kidney failure used to be managed with what we call peritoneal dialysis. That is where you would put catheters in the abdomen and then connect it to the machine so that blood would be cleaned that way. Mimi nilikuwa nafikiria ukifanywa dialysis inaendelea kuosha mpaka ipone. Baadaye daktari akaniambia enda tafuta pesa kijiji milioni ngapi uende Nairobi ufanywe transplant unatafuta ndugu yako mwenye atakusaidia so baada ya hapo tulianza kuongea mambo ya ya dona tulikaa tu kama friends brothers tukaitisha kama mkutano kidogo niko na mandugu wa tatu wa mama yangu sasa sasa wakaambua huyu ndugu yenu yako na shida na anataka msaada yenu in fact wote walisema mimi mimi kila mtu huyu mkubwa akasema au watoto wao sikukusaidia mimi ndio nitakusaidia hata na sababu kwa yote kama inawezekana tuka tukaenda naye kafanya hiyo matest sasa shida moja ilikuwa blood group ilikuwa tofauti tukasema huyu mwingine ni mdogo acha tu acha tupigie huyu mkubwa simu ikapigiwa simu ikaambiwa kama kama uko tayari kuja tuende tukunye alitoka Nairobi mpaka hapa kwa sababu ya hiyo so, watu wakati nilipima tu kuangalia ni sawa i thought that maybe 
really we it will be better that we that we do kidney transplantation for him because he doesn't have to trek all the way from Samburu to come for dialysis either in Mero or in Nairobi here. And uh, he will be rehabilitated, you know, to his former self where he becomes productive uh, to himself, to his family to, and to the society. <laughs> That is when I approached Nairobi Hospital. I specifically talked to, to Dr. Joan Osoro. Dr. Osoro took it up, thankfully, with the, with the hospital. And the hospital agreed to pay for the, for the cost of treatment for Charles Lepora. So, Bada and Kadimitu are very shirin. Very shirin, March 22 March. Kilgoa Tanafanyo Paracha. Chikuru Munga South, I Nikosa, Kamatuni Merudi. No, Kono Matumaini, Kosababu to me South and Mepona. Na pia tunasema Sentinel Hospital kwa sababu kama na inje kusaidia, hata saisi mimi sijui hata ningeka aje. Hospital actually uh, agreed to take that uh, uh, challenge and they have given life to somebody who, in my opinion, you know, would have come to a lot of grief 